We just heard some expert advice on how to find love in this big city of three million. Sometimes it can feel, still feel so lonely, but we are actually going to connect some people. We're gonna see love happen right here on the set. Let's welcome out Howie Gordon. We might know him from Big Brother, but yeah. he's here today. Woo! Which welcome. Where am I going? <laughs> yeah. Come on and sit right down. Thank you. Yeah. I know they're excited to see you. Hi, Ma. Oh, your mom's out oh, there. Oh, yeah, she. Oh, I love it. Thanks, okay. Whitney. So, Howie, tell us a little bit about yourself. A lot of people are probably remembering you from Big Brother. The How crazy, was that the crazy guy. Uh, yeah, big, Jedi. Jedi Howie. Beefcake yeah. Howie. Big Brother Hurricane Howie. Ooh, um, so many names. Big Brother was a few years ago. It was a lot of fun. Had a great time in California, getting sunshine, hanging out with a bunch of hot ladies. Ooh. Um, <laughs> but I'm a little, a little calmer now. More yeah. matured. Yeah, wisdomized. Looking for love. Yeah, that's what you, uh, that's what you tell me. That's why I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> You know, I did the blind date, I did the lemonade. Now I'm coming on a real show with integrity and uh, That's right. nice, lovely ladies. Oh, wonderful. So what are you looking for when it comes to a woman? Well, I mean, it kind of just has to happen, but obviously people are attracted to, to good-looking people, obviously. You know, I take care of myself, so I'm a borderline good-looking uh, good guy. <laughs> um, I want a nice girl. I, I don't want some uh, crazy party animal girl. You know, I've mm. done that for many years. Um, Obviously, you want to have things in common with people. Right. I like the beach. I like the outdoors. I like the, you know, every girl likes to shop. Every guy likes football. But what else can we have outside, above, and beyond that? <laughs> he is and, so great. Yeah, I agree. So I want to um, find the common ground. Common ground. Have things in common. Yeah. You like to work out like I do. Travel Blonde when I or... travel when I start making the big bucks like you do. <laughs> Blonde or brown hair? Do you um, have a preference? I really don't. I mean, it's a good the, answer. The, the, <laughs> I don't know if the hair makes somebody. I mean, but I don't know. I've been I've been going out with brunettes a lot lately, but oh, okay. I'm not, I'm not holding blondes out of the out of the uh, the vying for me. So how important is it? I know your mom's in the audience that your girls um, get along with your mom. You know, everyone's mom is gonna is gonna judge their so-called other person, and uh, so my mom has to like her. And I, I, what's a good girl? She doesn't like someone who you're dating. They don't like right. their family or their mother, even though a lot of families are crazy nowadays. Uh, but well, you, we, got, you got to be on par with the mom. That's, absolutely. That's, that's very important. We are actually going to blindfold you, but your mom is going to be able to see them all. So coming up remember next... Remember the codes, mom. Remember the codes. Yeah, then remember the codes. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, coming up next, we are going to start this love game. We're going to blindfold Howie and introduce him to the lovely ladies. We'll be right back. Today's Weekends with Whitney show is brought to you by Obj Dom V. The gorgeous Swarovski crystal jewelry is by designer Kirsten Gady for Obj Dom V. The look is modern sparkle. The style is everyday luxury. This is must have jewelry. Visit www.odecollection.com backslash Whitney for a special discount. Today's Weekends with Whitney show was taped at Lincoln Hall located at 2424 North Lincoln Avenue. The perfect location for any upcoming event. host Whitney Reynolds. Today love is in full bloom. So far we have figured out how to find love in the city and now we are hooking a brother up. Howie Gordon. <laughs> Howie Gordon is, um, we might know him from Big Brother, but he is looking for love here today on the set of Weekends with Whitney. So we are going to blindfold you or I am going to blindfold you. Here, let me do this real quick. And then we are going to have our lovely ladies come out because we know it's all not about looks, okay? So Let's see. Can you see no, I anything? I can't see. Okay. I, don't, I don't want to cheat. Okay, so he can't I see anything. I want to be real. I want love to be real. Oh, that's that's great. And that is why we we picked such a wonderful guy here today with us. <laughs> Thanks, so Wendy. let's welcome out our first girl. Tina C is 29 years old, a human resource and office manager from Equilibrium IT Solutions. Originally from Indiana, she moved here several years ago and loves Nothing more than a Chicago summer. Welcome, Tina. Hi. <laughs> now, <laughs> so Tina, I know you have a couple of dogs. I do. Yeah, and you love to walk them. I do. Is that one of your favorite activities? If not, what is? Um, well, I love walking my dogs, but I'd rather be tailgating in a Bears game. Ooh. <laughs> Uh, yeah, all the guys in the audience are going nuts over that one. Like, 
<laughs> okay, so you'd rather be tailgating at a Bears game. Now, do you think social media is good for a relationship? Uh, yes and no. I mean, it gives you too much of an opportunity to be nosy, but at the same time, I don't know. Keep some honest toes. Be honest, toes. yeah. A yeah. <laughs> little bit honest toes. And then do you believe in love at first sight? I do. Oh, are you in love with Howie right now? <laughs> I am. Oh, Good. Thanks, Tina. <laughs> Good answer again. I like again. you already. Yeah, I know. And then after how many dates do you take it to the next level? Oh, my. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Tina's mom in the audience. No. I think it all depends on the chemistry. Okay. So. Good answer. Okay, well, thank you so much, Tina. Thanks. Okay, guys, Thanks, let's Tina. give her a big round of applause. Okay, next up we have Jacqueline W. She is 24 years old, a PR executive, and a proud graduate of Kansas State. In her spare time, she also likes to walk her dog on the lakefront. Jacqueline, welcome out. Woo. This is taking me back to my childhood a little bit whenever I used to watch that one dating show, and it just seems like so much fun. Yeah, I know. Now, I know Jenny McCarthy, but, you know. <laughs> yeah, but welcome to the show, Jacqueline. Thanks for having me. Thank yeah, you. now, I'm going to ask you a lot of the same questions I just mm -hmm. asked Tina. What is your favorite thing to do on a lazy day? On a lazy day, let's say a lazy summer Chicago day. Definitely play volleyball. Ooh. Go on the beach. Um, that's definitely my go-to any day. Yeah, you do play a lot of volleyball. Mm -hmm. Do you think social media, being in PR, I'm mm -hmm. sure you love social media, but do you think social media is good on a little love relationship? No. I think social media is great in, for PR, but I think in a relationship, you should know each other well enough and not have those conversations face-to-face -face instead of finding out things yeah, Facebook. like so, posting no. on the wall like, you look cute, just yeah. call me, <laughs> you know? Hello, tell me in a text. Yeah, like, hello. hello, yeah. I know you. <laughs> Do you believe in love at first sight? Um, I feel like I should say yes, but no. Okay, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like you have to um, think less at first sight, but I think yeah. it's, I don't know, no? develops over time. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. it takes a little bit of time. And then after how many dates do you take it to the next level? Um, I don't know if that's appropriate for this show, <laughs> but... <laughs> wow! <laughs> do you want to sit in this chair, honey? Oh, wait. Um, <laughs> no, I don't know. Um, I guess it just depends. Okay, no, that's, that's good. Yeah. Good, safe answer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your mom's <laughs> probably loving never it Never know home. who's watching, right? You never know. That's a good... That's a good one. Well, Jackie, thank you so much thank for sharing you. your little questions. Howie, what are you thinking so far? Two nice girls. I'm, in, I'm, I'm into dogs, walking dogs. I'm into, I'm into the beach. <laughs> so, so far, they, we got a lot of things in common. Hard both, decisions, both, Howie. Both, yeah, very tough. Oh, <laughs> laying it thick, Jackie. Thank you so <laughs> much. Thank you. Okay, Thanks, last but not least. We have Morgan B., a 25-year-old office manager at a trading firm while attending graduate school. She describes herself as fun and ambitious. Welcome out, Morgan. Hello. Woo. Morgan, how are you? I am great. I'm excited to be here. Yeah, what are you thinking about Howie right now? <laughs> oh, he's cute. Woo. <laughs> He is so cute. Yes. Okay. So she what has is great taste, Whitney? She has great taste. I <laughs> So, once again, I'm going to ask the questions that I asked the other girls. Okay. What is your favorite thing to do on a lazy day? On a lazy day, bake. Oh. So, hopefully, it's a lazy day with other people or else I eat it all. Oh, yeah. I like to bake. I like to watch movies, mm. go to the gym if I can. So, you're a little baker. Yes. What do you think about social media in a relationship? Like, is it good, bad? Um, I think it depends. I think in any situation you have to be responsible with social media. I mean, you can't put up awful pictures and you can't put up inappropriate comments for like jobs and stuff. And I mean, if you trust who you're with, I don't think it's bad. I'm going to take this question a little bit deeper with you. Okay. Okay. What do you think about early on in a relationship? Do you post a picture with your guy to claim your stake? Um, why not? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Your family probably wants to see them. You yeah. want to share a picture. Share it with if the world. If you're excited, show them off. Absolutely. Do you believe in love at first sight? Yes. And what I do you like think? Of, okay. What do you think about Howie here? Well, I can't see his eyes. Oh, good wrong. answer. Oh, I, told, I told him wrong. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, he does have brown eyes. And then after how many dates do you take it to the next level? Um, I guess it depends on the guy. Okay. Good answer. It depends on the date. 
Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, she lets the guy take control. Oh yeah. Well, thank you so much, Morgan. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, Howie. You've heard from all three girls. What are we thinking so far? Don't give us an answer yet, but what are we thinking? I, I got some tough decisions here. I mean, the, the voice. I like all their voices. They're cute. Mm, yeah. Um, a lot. Of, all three of them sound like they have their head on their shoulders. They're into work. They're into focus. But they like to relax, walk their dogs, go to the beach. I, I got a tough one. It's absolutely. Uh, my lotto numbers might be easier. Oh no! Well, guys, coming up after the break, we are going to eliminate one of them. We'll be right back. Today's Weekends with Whitney show is brought to you by Ob J Dom V, Gail King, Stacy London, Michelle Branch, Stacy Keebler, Kyle Richards, and Whitney Reynolds. That's me. Are all famous fans of Ob J Dom V? Huge news! Starting February 18th, Weekends with Whitney is picking up an extra hour. Make sure to tune in at the regular time, 12 to 1, every Saturday and Sunday on NBC Chicago Nonstop. But then also make sure to watch our new time slot as well, 6 to 7 p.m. every Saturday. Welcome back to Weekends with Whitney. We are here at Lincoln Hall today doing Love is in Full Bloom. I'm loving this show. We're here with Howie Gordon. Now, we just met three lovely ladies. They shared a little bit of information about themselves, and we're going to have to eliminate one now. Yeah. Howie, how are you feeling? Oh. You, how, met, you met them. I didn't. I, well, he has been blindfolded the whole <laughs> time. So I want to kind of hear from the audience. We, we have the first one. Do we like her? Yeah. Okay. Woo. Yeah. Okay. I think they really like her. What, what, oh, what about number two? Yeah. Okay. And then number three. Okay. Wow. Howie, this oh. is when it, times get tough. Oh, geez. Who are we eliminating? Tell me and then I'll announce one, two, or three. Like right now? Yeah, tell me. Well, I, uh, I'm going to follow the applause of the crowd. I'm going to get rid of number three. Oh, number three. Okay, Howie, lift up your blindfold. We're going to welcome out Morgan B. See who you said goodbye to. Oh. Oh, what a mistake I made. Oh. Please. Oh. Thanks, Morgan. Yeah. Thanks. Round two is the chocolate round. Okay, we have both chocolate. They, each girl picked out some kind of unique blend. So it's chocolate and something else, and they're gonna feed it to you. I love chocolate and anything. Ooh, yeah, <laughs> chocolate and anything. Okay, so the girls are gonna feed it to you and tell you why they picked it, okay? <laughs> Let's welcome back out Tina C. <laughs> Woo, Tina. Yeah, now you picked out some uh, chocolate. I have a... Do I yeah, what kind? Okay, caramel toffee bar. Oh, caramel. Why'd you pick caramel? Because I love caramel. Ooh, she loves. <laughs> and there were some weird flavors, so this what? was the okay. most normal. <laughs> okay, so there were some weird ones. I know I've tried one of theirs with wasabi in it. Yeah. Wasabi chocolate. That scared me a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> wasabi, like wasabi wasabi? Yeah, in some chocolate. <laughs> I would see, I would have picked that one. That would have been like, yeah. So you picked the caramel, okay, and now you're just going to feed it to Howie. Now. This is like the first like interaction y'all have had, so we're gonna see it all unfold right here. Yeah. All right, are you ready? You or me? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Mm. Is it delicious? Wow, that's good. 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 <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Do you want some more? Yes, yes, please. Oh. I've been dieting up until I, I, I did two workouts last night, so I'm entitled, right? Yeah. Less talking, more chocolate. Oh, <laughs> Tina just told him. She could have said, less talking, more chocolate. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. What are we thinking about Tina so far? Well, I, I love chocolate, and she's a chocolate <laughs> lover, so that's, that's definitely high on the, uh, yeah. on, the, um, uh, on, the, on the scale. Now, whatever, whatever girl you pick, you're going to be taking them to Gay House, and they have chocolate fondue. Mm. Oh, wow. mm. Yeah, it's so yummy. Okay, so any questions? Because this is your last interaction with Tina until the elimination again. I can ask her anything? Ask her anything. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, PG. Oh. PG. No, no, no. Okay. I'm, uh, this is a family show. My mom's yes, here. My sorry. sister's here. You're right. <laughs> my grandma my grandma didn't have a gymnastics meet. She'd be here. <laughs> um, 
Oh, what kind of dogs do you have? Did you, did you tell me? You I, just, I actually have Shih Tzus. Oh, My yes. dog is Whitney's dog's boyfriend. That is right, yeah. <laughs> My dog's boyfriend is her little one. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. I know. So is that the main question? Anything else you want to know? Um, you said you like the beach. Well, I was the one that liked tailgating. You like tailgating. Way to remind So you bought football. Now, is it, is I it do. so when the Bears are gone, are you no longer watching football anymore? No, I still watch. Yeah, I'm a football so you, fan in okay, general. I like That's, sports. I like so. You will always find her at um, some kind of location watching a game. Always. Yeah. So where's the Super Bowl party at? Yeah. Uh, oh, sure. we'll have to I have see a couple if you get to that point. Out. <laughs> okay. Tina, thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, we're going to welcome back out Jacqueline W. Jacqueline, where are you with your chocolate? Oh, here she comes. Right here. Okay. Woo! Now, what chocolate did you pick out? Okay, so since they all had really unique ingredients, I just went safe and did the Barcelona bar because I love to travel, Ooh. which entails sea salt, deep milk chocolate, and hickory smoke almonds. Ooh, she's giving you the details. <laughs> she's a detail girl. So I love it. It's all in the details. Most of it. <laughs> okay, so. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> I, I haven't eaten since breakfast. Oh my gosh. Okay. Ooh, Close. There you go. Close. <laughs> yeah, you not only like give good, you like give good direction all the way around. Yeah, it must be. It must be the PR side of me. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. Good direction. Oh, good. What do you think? Oh. I like it. Yeah. Like, well, we don't want to well, know if you like it more than the caramel, but are we really liking it? I haven't Can tried I it. Yeah, oh. definitely. Let me just. <laughs> okay. He's ready. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> An eager beaver. Yeah. He's loving it. Yeah. So any other questions? Why? Oh, and she's trying it. Give me a little bite of that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. well, that's yummy. Um, the almonds. Okay, so any questions that you want to ask Jackie oh, why she's so out here? Many. Why she's out here? No, why she's out here. Why she's out here? Yeah, I guess that's a good question. Why are you out here? <laughs> um, what, what are your normal methods of dating? Oh. Okay, like, what do you find on Facebook, at the, at the library, at the, at the movies, um, at okay. the bar? Awesome. Night um, club? Yeah, <laughs> all, all great options. But um, I think, coincidentally, I have a dog as well, a little doxy pom. The dog mm, park. Uh, how'd you guess? Must, oh. be a, must be a thing for you too, I've huh? Been out there. I've been out there. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> so I would say the dog park, the normal park, and um, you know, I, like I said, I play a lot of volleyball, so I've met a lot of men on the beach. Mm. So the beach. The beach. Well, thank you so much, Jackie. Thanks, Jackie. Yeah. Thank you. You might be seeing her again very soon. Okay. Howie, lift up that blindfold. Because this is where it, what it all comes down to. Oh. It's time to pick your winner. Really? Yeah, we're going to pick someone. Oh, Let's hear from the audience again. Who are we liking? One? Yeah. Or two? Yeah. Oh. oh, look at that. They're holding up numbers and stuff. I love this. They're, there, I see a mixed crowd. There's ones and twos everywhere. Wow. Look, everyone's holding up their numbers. Could get a count. Hold on. We get a count here. <laughs> oh, the pressure. I know, the pressure. The weather was easier than this. Oh, I know. The weather job's easier than this. Yeah. You could be wrong all the time. <laughs> okay. Wrong here. It could be. Uh, it could be. be a really lost, bad. Lost love and you'd be seeing stuff. It's a in long the city. winter, a cold winter. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so let's pick someone. Who right now? Right now. No more commercial breaks until you pick someone. <laughs> All right, uh, uh, majority rules, I'll go with number one. Okay. So before, before we welcome out number one, let's note. Oh, I see number two hide. First, don't I? Yeah, hide back there. We're going to bring out number two first. We're going to bring out who you eliminated. Oh. Oh, this is Jackie. Here she is. Oh, oh. Jesus. <laughs> nice to meet you. Sorry. No. The chocolate was great. Oh, Jackie, you did great. And now let's see your bride to be, Tina. <laughs> let's welcome out Tina. Here she is. Wow. <laughs> nice to meet you. Jesus. 
Well, and you guys match. You do? Oh, you yeah. match. I'm not good with that, but yeah. So now here is your date to Gay Haas. It's going to be really romantic, but you know there's a lot to do there, so you'll be able to stay active talking, all that kind of stuff. Sounds like you have a lot in common. What do you think? Here you go, Howie. Um, about having a lot in common? I think we do. Well, what uh, do you think about Tina? Oh, she's physically awesome. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> um, dogs, football, there's not much we don't have in common, so I mean. I love it. It'll be up to me to probably mess it all up, so uh, I'll try well, to Wonderful. Well, thank you so much, Howie. Oh, Tina, you. you're great. Thanks, I can't wait to hear about this date. Guys, to find out more about their date, go to our Facebook page, Weekends with Whitney. We'll give you the lowdown on how it went down. But coming up next, we've introduced them to love, and now we're going to find out ways to keep it together. We'll be right back. Today's Weekends with Whitney show is brought to you by Abje Dom V. Abje Dom V's jewelry has been featured in Women's Wear Daily, The Wall Street Journal, Lucky Magazine, and Elle. You can get the look at www.odecollection.com backslash Whitney. Beautiful pieces priced from $18 to $300. Want more of Weekends with Whitney? Well, now you got it. Find us on Facebook and Twitter. Simply search Weekends with Whitney on Facebook and on Twitter, Weekends Whitney. Today's Weekends with Whitney show was taped at Lincoln Hall, located at 2424 North Lincoln Avenue, the perfect location for any upcoming event.